And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another weekend of Harvest Moon. Good morning, Rex. How you doing, little buddy? I have missed you. <laughs> and I missed all of you guys last weekend. I apologize. Was not feeling good. So uh, I uh, just tried to take it easy and got some rest. Managed to uh, get better. I'm feeling great now. And we're back with Harvest Moon. How you doing, Karen? Phew, it's becoming hard to even walk now. Ah, uh, well, it's okay, Karen. Not too much longer, hopefully. Let's uh, check the calendar out. I know we missed the horse races, unfortunately. But we do have the cooking festival coming up in the next day or two. Uh, anything significant going on today? No. All right, well, we got some work to do, and Karen, I got some work to do out in the farm today, so I'm gonna go get started. All right, so let's go ahead and check the mail. Come here, you mail. Hey, nothing has come. No one loves me. No one loves me. All right, so how's the farm doing? Okay, okay, looking good. Cucumbers, okay, get, weed, get out of here. We don't need you in here. Are you ready? No. And this stuff isn't even ready yet. Needs to hurry up. I don't have all spring. Hey, what are you doing in my flowers? Get out of here. Are these... These aren't even done yet, are they? Hmm. I should probably start watering these. <laughs> I think I have not been watering these. I should probably water them. It seems like they're taking a little while to grow. They might be something special, and I'll probably just need to harvest them all and save them and put them, like, in my cabinet or something. The yellow ones I'm not too worried about. Those are relatively easy to come by. I think. <laughs> they seem to be. All right, well, let's go ahead and get some watering done. We're not going to have to water everything, because those turnips over there are purely for decoration. And, uh... Anything that decides to make its way in here. Maybe if Rex gets hungry, I don't mind him eating on those. But I don't know what was in here last week when we had the animals out. Whatever that was. Someone, I think someone said it was like a wolf or a hound or something. I don't know what it was, but... <laughs> I don't want it in my farm. And it was by my crops, which is one thing I don't want. I don't mind if he's outside, and I'll catch him but it's like the worst possible scenario, and I don't like that. I don't know if he can do anything to your crops, but I don't want him in here. <laughs> it's, like my, it's like my privacy, you know? I don't want no one in my farm. Stay out. That's why I have it fenced off. <laughs> There's a reason for it. All right, anyway, we got to go see how Luna's doing. Let's go ahead and finish these cucumbers up right here. There we go. Awesome. Luna. Here, girl, where are you at? There you are. How's your Luna doing today? There, there, Luna. Grow up fast. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna finally get you to grow up. Be big, strong. Come here, let me brush you. There you go. All right, you stay out here and be good. Let's go check up on the other animals. See how they're doing. Make sure they're okay after all that uh, craziness last last time. Let's see, come here, you. So I don't know if we need all of the yarn or not, but we're gonna just hold on to it and probably ship it. <laughs> Thinking that's what we're gonna do. There, there, Mareep, you look happy today. There, there, Flaffy, you look happy today too. Alright, let's ship it. It's gone. It's gone. Alright, next up. Cows, get out of the way. Move! Come here. Come here, you. No sleeping on the job. We got stuff to do. Hello, Toros. You seem to be in a good mood today. Where's Miltank? Come here, you. Everyone's gonna get on to me. Bentley, Toros is male. Okay. <laughs> Still a Pokemon. Still a normal type. And that's, to me, what a cow would be. A normal type. 
I need some other normal type names. Alright, so maybe, just maybe, we'll see about getting ourselves some more animals very soon. Thinking we probably should. Maybe, like, let's see, check the money real quick. Let's see. Okay, yeah, I think we're, I think we're good on money. <laughs> uh, we got about, I'm gonna say about 15000 to spend that I'd be happy with. You know, I want to make sure I have some in my back pocket for later on. Just in case it decides to rain a little too hard. If you picking up the catchphrase I'm going for there. <laughs> Saving money for a rainy day. Yeah, that one. So, yeah, I think it'd be a good idea just to save a little bit of money for later on. Just in case something happens. And fill this up. Throw that in there. Get the honey. Take care of our crops. The day is going smoothly. It's going well. Alright, let's go ahead and water all of you. Come here. And you. Alright, now I don't quite remember what I have growing in here. Hmm. Well, regardless, <laughs> it'll be done soon, I hope. Then we'll get some other stuff going. I don't know what all I'm waiting for, or actually how to unlock some of the seeds that we're going to need soon. I keep forgetting, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I, like, took the entire way around to get to this screen. Alright, so strawberries, I have no idea how to get. Hopefully I can figure that out very soon. Alright, I need potatoes. I think we have cabbages growing right now. Onions. I believe that's spinach, and I think that's actually what I'm growing in my hothouse, if I remember correctly now. Um, milk, we have 37 out. We need more yarn and wool, it looks like, if we need it. Not sure. Uh, green peppers or bell peppers, I'm not quite sure what that is. On the right side, third down from the top. So, a few more things left. I'm not too sure how to get some of those, but we'll keep an eye out for them. Go take care of our poke chickens. All right, fellas. Let's check the eggs. Gotta make sure they're doing good. All right, pokey eggs are looking good. You got any more? Yep, a few more. Darn, one left. Couldn't have given you that extra one slot. <laughs> they just couldn't have, but it's okay. I've been getting some requests to play some other Harvest Moons. I'm kind of unsure on this because, for one, I don't know. Like, some of these um, requests I've been getting are for, like, PSP or the GameCube or some Nintendo system, which I don't even own a Nintendo system anymore. Um, I actually passed that on to um, my uh, brother and his family for his kids and such later on. But uh, yeah, I don't even own a Nintendo console anymore. So um, I actually own a, a handheld, but I don't have any way to record that. So yeah, getting all these requests, but no way to actually play these Harvest Moon games. And I can't really afford a um, new console right now. I can't even afford a PlayStation or an Xbox One. So, yeah, but we're gonna have to get a little creative possibly with our next one if uh, we so desire to hop on Harvest Moon still. Uh, but I'm not gonna be ending this off anytime, well, I'm not gonna say anytime soon, but we still got a ways to go. I still got a few things left that might take a little while to do. Like, I want to get Luna to finally grow up, for one. And I think I'm going to go for trying to get a hundred of everything in here sold or shipped. Um, I think I might exclude the yarn, because that seems like that's going to take a really long time. The yarn and the wool, so a um, couple um, tasks I want to get finished there. And uh, my, my child, of course. So uh, let's, let's go ahead and uh, head on over to, um, 
I think it's Barley. I think we want to go talk to Barley. Um, we might go ahead and see about picking up uh, some more sheep. Maybe two more sheep and or a cow or two. Hmm. See, now the problem is I gotta find names. I don't know of any. Drat! Um. Hmm. Wait, can we go out here? I don't know if I've ever been out here. Oh, hello, little one. Hey, are you going shopping today? I'm guessing. Is there nothing significant out here? Okay. Alright, we pick up cows. We need names. What are the names? Hmm. Need Pokemon names. Normal types. Hmm. This could be rather difficult because there's so many Pokemon now. There's like 600 or something. I don't know. They're getting close to a thousand. <laughs> That'll be the day. Um. Herm. Wow. And they even have fairy types out too now. Well, if it isn't the guy from the Moo Moo Farm. Is there something you need? Yeah. Oh, wow. Cows are 6,000. Those are a little bit more than I thought. Darn it. All right. Um, so you will you be giving it a name? Yeah, I guess I'll probably need to, huh? huh. <laughs> Darn it. I don't want to, like, I'm sitting here going, like, Radicate, and I'm like, no, because Radicate's, like, Got huge teeth and is a rat. A cow is not a rat. <laughs> um. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Maybe it's not that great, but it'll work for now. We're gonna call this one. Darn it, is it an S E Y or is it S Y? Drat. How do I go back? Pretty sure it's with the E. If not, then I like it with the E better. It looks better. Alright, we're going with that. Chansey. Is this name okay? Yes. Thank you, I'll have it put inside your barn. Do you want to buy anything else? Maybe one more sheep. Hmm. I guess we might as well go ahead and uh, continue the trend with a sheep. We'll call this one Ampharos. Very original. I hope we have enough characters. Oh snap, just enough and I... Ampharos? Is it A-R-O-S? Let's take a look. All right, that looks that looks to be more correct. I like it anyway, so that's what I'm gonna go with. There we go. Is this name okay? Thank you. I'll have it put inside your barn. Do you want to buy anything else? Nah, I'm good. Thanks, Barley. Appreciate it. If you need to buy anything else, please stop by again. All right, we'll do, Barley. We'll just do one and one for now. We might uh, pick up another cow later on, but uh, one of each would be fine. I don't want to get you know myself overwhelmed with cattle. Because um, <laughs> I think the more we have, the longer it's gonna take. Of course, we could see about asking the sprites to help us with that. I was meaning to do that. All right, maybe we'll do that tomorrow. Yeah, I think we, I think we might hold off on that till tomorrow. All right, so the farm's looking pretty decent. I gotta say, it's not looking too bad. Got a few things we need to clean up around. Let's do that real quick. We need to fix you. 
See, I'm always worried about fixing the uh, fence up. Because every time I do, I feel like the RNG, because I'm pretty sure I'm I'm not 100% on this, that the randomness, if you guys don't know what RNG means, we'll just say the randomness comes by and says, okay, well this block or this log needs to be broken or destroyed. So I think that's what happens and it just like gets greater when you don't have that many sitting around, so yeah. Don't know what I want to do about that. All right, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call it a day. We'll uh, head over to the supermarket tomorrow because I think they're closed today. Sorry, I think I might have tapped the mic. Um, yeah. Karen, what you doing over here? I'm thinking about the menu for you right now. Is it the right time to eat? Can I not sit in my chair? I want to sit in my chair. No. That'd be so cool if you could, like, man. Like, all these small little things that they could do and make, like, a new, awesome, amazing Harvest Moon game. Just, like, build off, like, this one right here. Um, which is, to me, like, already built off, like, the original, in my, my opinion. But, um, make it to where you could sit down with your family at night, eat supper and stuff like that. Just make it like almost like a pure simulator. <laughs> I guess in a sense. But uh, yeah, that'd be kind of cool. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and head off to bed for tonight. See you guys bright and early in the morning. Good night. And good morning, Karen. Morning, Rex. How you doing, little buddy? He's doing good. And you feeling okay, Karen? Phew, it's becoming harder to even walk now. Oh, Karen. If you need help, you let me know. Just, uh, yell for me. I'll be out in the farm. Except for later, I need to go visit your dad. I need to pick up some flour, and then I gotta see the sprites. But, yeah, just call for me later. Oh, good morning, Mayor. Tomorrow is the cooking festival. Starts at 10 a.m. in the square. Be sure to come. If you bring a homemade dish, you can enter it in the contest then. Ooh. What am I really good at making? Ooh. We should totally make pizza. Do we, do we have the stuff for that? Might have to go to the store. Anyway. Yeah, we sure need to do that tomorrow. I think... <gasps> Potatoes are ready. Sweet. I think this is the um, other thing we needed, so let's go ahead and harvest these guys up. How many do we need? 82 is what we have, and we should have enough to finish this off, so that is good. And then all we gotta do is plant something else here, but I don't know if we really have a whole lot of time to plant something else right now. In fact, I don't even know what else we can plant. We we don't need turnips. Those are just there to look nice. <laughs> we'll plant those or uh, harvest those before the um, season ends. But hmm, what else is there? We'll have to go check it out at the uh, supermarket and see if there's anything else that we need. I don't know if Juan has anything special for like spring. I don't remember. Or was it the cabbages? Might have been the cabbages. Right, there's that, and finish. <gasps> Ooh, I think these are done. Yes, finally. Good. I think I need those. And I think that's just enough uh, for what we need to finish off for the uh, cabbages, too. So that is awesome. Might even just... Oh, ah, darn it. I didn't mean to do that. Might even just leave all of this um, soil open. Just keep it tilled for summer. Oops, didn't mean to do that. All right, there we go. Let's go dump this and we'll go harvest up those cabbages. Which means we won't have a whole lot to really water today. All we're gonna water is the cucumbers and we really don't even have to do that. Ah, nice. Okay, so we just picked these guys up. These do not regrow. 
Wait, did I just pick up two? I might have actually accidentally pulled one out of my bag. <laughs> my bad. I thought I picked up like two of them or something. I don't know, this way seems to be a little bit faster doing it like this. Not 100% sure on this, so don't, don't quote me on that. Just seems faster. All right, so how many of these did we actually need, Cambages? All right, we have 47, so we needed 53 to top off the 100. So we got nine here, nine here. Is that right? Nine there. So that'd be um, 27 plus another 27. Oh yeah, we got we got enough. It should be about. 60, I think, if my math is correct. Because I think we got an extra three on the end here. Which kind of makes me wonder if I counted this right. So I think I might just go back to the whole counting length and width here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, darn it. <laughs> oh, I look like a fool. Alright, so there's four. There's four and another five, so yeah, I guess that's an easy way to do it. So, what is that? Nine times, wait, seriously? Is that nine? Did I seriously count that wrong earlier? I guess I did. I was trying to eye it from the center of each, and I think that's probably what was throwing me off. Yeah, so that'd be nine. Four there and then another five. So nine by three is 27, and 27 times two would be a 54. Right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, see, I'm, co I'm confusing myself and questioning my abilities because of eyeing this on this side and not getting that right, so I blame myself. Don't worry about it. Pretty sure we will be just fine. And if not, we have a hot house. We'll grow it again later on. But I'm fairly positive we'll be all right. Just finish harvesting this up because it's almost four o'clock and yep, we got stuff to do. All right, I think we probably should go ahead and just head off to the supermarket real quick before it gets too late and I keep getting worse at math here. You did not just, oh, come on. All right, little Bentley, you're messing us up here. Get away from that. Oh, this is insane. Things couldn't get worse. Or maybe they could. All right, let's get out of here. Supermarket. Karen, I'm going to the supermarket. I'll be back later. I'll tell your dad hi for you. All right, let's go. Got stuffs to do. Flour to buy. I think I'm probably gonna hold on to some flour for me too. Would probably be a smart idea if I wanna cook a pizza for the cooking festival tomorrow. This store better be open too. Barry better be open. Yeah, there we go. All right, all right, so springtime seeds, I think are right here. Those are fruits and vegetable seeds over there. If you have a hothouse, you can plant any seed any time of the year. But if you intend to grow plants outside, use the... All right, yeah, all right, Pierre, I got you. Grass turnip, yeah, I got all those, we're good. Well, we always have seeds there for sale. Thank you, Pierre, I need some flour. A lot of it. Flour is used for baking sweets. It costs 50 gold, would you buy some? Yeah, Pierre, I'm, I'm gonna need to buy um, quite a few of these. So if you don't mind, um, I'm probably gonna need like eight of them or so. I think that's what I'm gonna probably wanna pick up. But uh, yeah, your daughter's uh, do she's doing good, and uh, you know I've been I've been cooking for her. You know the baby's coming along nicely. I think she hasn't gone to the doctor. I haven't seen her at the doctor at least. Um, I don't know if she's gone to the doctor, but um, I I'm guessing everything's okay. <laughs> Nothing bad's happened yet, so guessing very soon if you're wondering where, where the baby's at baby should be here soon so yeah how are we good are we good six 
All right, I'm, I'm just gonna call it there, Pierre. Um, I, I'll see you later, buddy. Yeah, later. <laughs> I'll tell Karen hi for you. All right, and so we're gonna go give the uh, sprites a few bags of flour. Or at least uh, Aqua and um, the other one. I don't remember their names. Um, you. Did you come to offer me a job, Boodum? I like working, but then I wouldn't be able to go to the tea party, Boodum. Oh, wait, you got one of them tea party things here? When is that? Anyway, I keep forgetting about this thing, and I know it only happens in the spring, I just don't know when. Here you go, buddy. Yippee Yahoo! Thank you very much! No problem, Boodum. Alright, and then you, I give you some flour too. Yippee Yahoo! Thank you very much! I'm looking for a pretty tablecloth for the tea party, Boodum. Work? But I've been looking forward to a tea party, Boodum. All right, so I'm guessing you guys are probably just not super happy with me right now. Oh, I should probably go check out the um, new animals, which I need to do. Oh, I'll c oh wait. Have we always had a heart with all of them? I don't think we did. But I got two with Stade and Aqua now, which is cool. I think I might have them start working on animals. I think they'll be able to get those um, done fairly quickly. And I'm pretty sure they can take care of them if I'm not in there, I hope. Otherwise, there wouldn't be a point in it. Hmm. Why don't you just take a look and do some testing? Nonetheless, I still think I might have to go talk to all the animals. That way they get some, uh, some TLC, you know, some love from Bentley. They gotta know I care, you know? Six p.m. on the dot. We still got cabbages to harvest. All right, we still got a little bit of work to do. In fact, we still have to take care of the cattle, the hot house. We have everything left to do. It's been a long, tedious day. All right, we'll finish this up. No problem. All right, I'm pretty sure the other cabbages shipped, so we can pretty much see what we have left. So we have 85 now, which means we have these 15 left. Wait a minute. Did I waste one? Or was my math seriously wrong? I thought we was gonna be over by one. Cause 27 and 27 is 54. And it was like at 53. Oh wait a second, what am I doing? Ah! No! <laughs> Darn it, the math! Stop it! I can't help it, I like math, and I love figuring stuff out. And that's why it's boggling my mind. 53 and... Was it... 54? I don't even remember the numbers anymore. I'm lost. I eh, just forget it. We'll have enough. <laughs> we'll meet the 100. That's all that matters. Good. We got some flour. I'll probably look back at it later on and see it and see what I did wrong, if anything. I'll be back shortly, Karen. We're almost done. So I got a little bit left to do, I guess. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. What? It's just I don't know. Anyway, let's go ahead and finish up this little bit here. Pick up the rest of these cabbages. Now, we won't know for sure until tomorrow, but I'm fairly certain we'll have enough as long as we don't waste any. We don't, maybe that's, maybe I misclicked one or, I, I'm, I'm just gonna, just drop it, Billy. just drop it. It's okay. It's all right. It's just a little bit of math. But math is your favorite. Oh, hush you. <laughs> oh, Lord. Here we go. At least talking to himself. All right, put that away. Put you down. Oh, nope. This one. All right, we're clear. We're good. All right. Let's go take care of the 
animals and uh, the new cattle we got. The new cows. Ooh, we got another sheep. I guess that might be one way we could get a whole bunch of uh, easy wool is to uh, sell sheep and then buy them. <laughs> I guess that's one way to do it. Hello, Toros. You seem to be in a good mood today. Alright, let's do a little bit of milking, shall we? And you're all the way over here down the corner. There, there, Chansey. You look happy today. Chansey's not going to be providing us with any milk soon. Which is okay. Hello, Miltank. You seem to be in a good mood. Moo. Indeed. There, there, Flaffy. Alright, and let's go ahead and drop off this milk. Gosh, so many animals. Eh. Move. <laughs> Can't get through. Scared I'm going to miss. I think everyone's sleeping. My goodness, Ampharos, you sure seem to be in a sour mood today. Are you alright, Ampharos? That's not good. Do you think Barley gave me a, a sick sheep? A black sheep, maybe? I bet he gave me a black sheep. <laughs> that is just not even right. I should get free medicine for that. Like seriously, I just bought the animal from Barley and he's like sick apparently. If not, he's not feeling good or he wasn't happy to be in Barley's care. I might have to go talk to him about this. We ain't got time to do that tonight. We gotta go take care of the hot house and then we gotta go uh, take a um, peek at our polka chickens. And we should be good to go, but it looks like we got pineapples to harvest. Great. Wonderful. That's fine. We'll do that real quick. Won't take long. And then tomorrow is the cooking festival, so we got to make some uh, food tomorrow. And we're going to see about entering up this, uh, this cooking festival tomorrow. I don't know if I've ever participated in it, to be honest. I think it's about time we, we, we enter and win. It's the year of Bentley. <laughs> That's what I'm going to go for. The year of Bentley. All right. Pineapples, give us money. And with that, we can actually... I think these are like five or six hundred each, so that's like what, uh, four thousand per n or per harvest for each square. So it'd be like eight thousand for these two uh, plantations. I'm not sure at the actual amount of these, so I'm just kind of speculating. But that'd be enough to buy like another cow at least, which we'll do later on. There we go. All right, we're good. Let's go take care of our polka chickens. In fact, I think we need to feed the fish, too. Come here, fish. You know what? I want to be super nice. I'm even going to feed the fish honey. Enjoy. <laughs> I don't know if that's good or bad. I don't know if that's going to be bad. I don't know, maybe it'll speed up the uh, the breeding process, who knows. Alright, you sleeping poke chickens, did I not? I'm pretty sure I fed them. I think they're just lined up like that because... Whoops, sorry buddy. Because uh, it's night time and they're sleeping. And this is how they sleep apparently. Pretty sure I fed them though. No matter. We'll just finish up the pokey eggs here. Mayonnaise just takes way too long. We'll just do our little egg trick there. And hopefully soon if we can get the uh, harvest sprites, we might not have to worry about doing this anymore. Wait, I wonder, do they actually, the harvest sprites actually even feed them too? That would be amazing. 
Because I'm pretty sure they could probably master that in no time. Be like super efficient at it. Oop, oh, oh, mountain chicken feed. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be running out anytime soon. All right, well, I think it's time for us to go ahead and head off to bed and call it a day. I think we've done well enough to say that. Let's go ahead and uh, head off back to the house. Tell Karen goodnight. Maybe bring Rex back to the bed with us. Come on, buddy. You can sleep back in the room with us again tonight. No worries. Oops. No! Don't you... Rex, don't you do this. Karen's sleeping. Rex? Rex? Rex, come here. Rex, come here. Karen's sleeping. And apparently you are sleeping right at the door. Really? There we go. I got him. Rex? I told you to come. Alright. Anyways. Thank you guys. Sleep good. We'll see you guys bright and early in the morning. Good night.